be. Looking good? You mean, considering the shit we've been through? Well, factor that in, and you look fucking amazing. So, ready to tell me what we're doing here? Well, been tinkering with virtues a lot lately and figured out a way to scroll two actors' experiences at the same time. Thought we could try it out. If you're down, of course. How does one marry two separate neural tracks? Well, at first I tried to create a single profile out of two data streams. Didn't turn out so great. Must have gotten tangled up. Interference, white noise. Yeah, effect was kind of like a bad art house. Couple tries in, though. I managed to isolate specific sensations. So you load them onto separate neural tracks. No emo bogeys. Not bad. What do I gotta do? You, my friend, are just gonna scroll me a virtue. That's it. Now, now, let's not get ahead of ourselves. This could be my greatest work ever. Sounds like we could do this anywhere. Why did we come all the way out here? What is this place? Cottage belonged to someone I knew. It sits empty now. I take the liberty to use it from time to time. And that's where we're gonna scroll? No, we're gonna scroll underwater. Nope, no way. Bad idea. Tell her to find some other yes woman. What do you say? You in? Why would you say that? I don't know. Don't like the idea, that's all. It's just, when I think about the dark, the deep, Palms that I don't fucking have get clammy with sweat I don't secrete. You're more than welcome to stay on shore. Hell yeah, I'm in. Awesome. So, uh, let's go. Got the hardware here. Get that booty of yours suited up. Do this often? What? Make other girls put on skin-tight wetsuits? <laughs> Mint diving. As often as I can. As for the rest, well... I'm picky about my girls. Why'd you choose this, of all places? Why? Don't like it? It's okay, but... Any special reason why you chose this one? Of course there is. But you'll have to wait to find out what it is. Let's get this scroller on ya. Water's toxic. That not a problem? Whole reason we're suiting up. Haven't even asked me if I know how to swim. Not worried I'll just sink to the bottom like a bag of rocks? A bag of rocks? Come on, don't sell yourself short. Look pretty damn fine in that wetsuit. You should see me in my Max Tech uniform. Whoa, mean you have one? Indeed I do. Won it in a bet. Still hangs in my closet waiting for the right occasion. Huh? I'm gonna hold you to that. All right, let's do this. Whew, freezing ass water, here I come. Okay, we're all set. You go first. Stay close behind me, and don't descend too fast. Where are we headed, exactly? About halfway to the deepest point. It'll be pitch black, but the currents are gentle. Ought to be safe. Want the precise coordinates? Now why bother? I'll just stick close to you. 
Okie dokes. Virtues are more to you than just a way to churn out eddies, huh? Well, duh. Think it. Paintings, songs, they're meant to produce emotion responses. Generally how any kind of creativity works, sure. Right, so art's a casing, trigger for emotion. Well, BDs are emotion in near pure form. Is it? Swim over here and look straight at me, will you? Great. Great. Signal's clear. Just need your help with a few basic checks. Need to calibrate our gear. First up, motion sensors and scrolling. Circle around me. Swim. calibrated. Now swim hither. Next up, sound check. I'm gonna hum a song. You give me the title. Read me. <laughs> I know that. Eddie Sorrentino, only you. Never did go in for sentimental stuff. Got stuck in my head lately, though, that one. All right, that ought to do it. We are now... Synced. Why now? Prepare to have your mind blown. Wait for it. Now grab this and hold on tight. Down we go. Impressive, huh? <laughs> That's incredible. What is it? Our very own Atlantis. It used to be called Laguna Bend. Just 15 years ago, people still lived here. Yeah, I remember. NC Dam Limited made plans to build a dam. People protested and... The rest is history. Houses, playgrounds, all flooded. Got some connection to this place, right? You got it. Grew up here. Haven't been back since Laguna Bend was wiped off the map. Why are you showing me this? It's important to me. Got a feeling this will be perfect for my experiment. Why does this stand to be perfect? Hoping you'll be able to pick up all the unfiltered mess of emotions this place brings out in me. Like it or not, you'll react to those feelings. That's what I want to capture. Sounds Nova. Let's do this. Played this moment coming back so many times in my head. Taking me years. Working up the nerve for this. Why didn't you come earlier? Good question. Easy answer would be that I didn't have time. Gear, stars weren't ever aligned. Truth is, the very idea just felt weird. Besides, didn't want to come here alone. Or with some rando. Flows 
Joe's Diner, best eatery in town? Only one at that, too. Burgers weren't amazing, too greasy. Big. Of course, I say that now. Back then, they were the best thing I'd ever chewed and swallowed. And next door, that's where we lived. Me and my grandparents. Just let me know when you want to forge ahead. Looks like this fell off your one and only eatery. Let's see now. Your childhood tasted like scop dog from Capitan Caliente with habanero sauce extra hot. Of course, tasted even better when you stole them off the stand. You know what they say. It ain't caliente if it don't burn on the way in and out. Weird place for a framed picture. Water probably carried it out of someone's house. Anything to make out? No, not much. Got something here. Looks like an old photo cam. DPI 350. Practically an antique. Like it? You kidding? It's awesome. Hockey stick? Is there a skating rink here? I wish. Played street hockey on rollerblades. Quit schmoozing, Alvarez. We're losing because of you. Come It's dead meat anyway. Sorry, you gotta go. They're calling. Here, take this camera. Better off in your hands than sitting here collecting algae. Gosh, thanks. What about your parents? Dad was never in the picture. Mom died when I was tiny. Can barely remember her. I still have her picture, but, you know, I see a stranger there. Judy, Judy, watch out for her kids. Those voices. Voices? Didn't hear anything but you just now. What was it like living with your grandparents? How were they? Granddad had a real knack for things technical. Taught me everything I know. And the stories he told. Ugh, never got bored listening to him. And Grandma was temperamental. Hot one second, cool as steel the next. Let's keep going, Judy. Aye, aye, Captain. Follow me. We're looking for anything in particular here? Nah. Can't hurt to look around, though. Picking up very chill vibes. It feels like we're outside of time, like in a snow globe. After that, we can see what lies up ahead. say, don't really get why they left their wheels behind when they had to evacuate. Hey, how old do you think I am? These hunks of metal have got half a century on them. When I was about yay high, they were already here. And not in much better shape. It's good cover for playing Max Tack and Psychos, though. Imagine anything that could be more out of place in an underwater world. Mmm. Bottled water? <laughs> touché, Judy, touché.
this isn't yours? Poor thing. Been here all alone for 20 years. So it is yours? No. It was Jenny Chapman's. You took her doll? As if. Hit it. It was a monster. You hit it? W why? Because I thought only losers played with dolls. What I really wanted was for her to notice me. Ah, the days when dolls were just kids' toys and nothing else. Want to see what's further on? Come on, then. Want to show you something. Got no idea how weird it feels swimming through here. Where you used to run, as a kid. Where daily life grinded along. You can imagine it a bit. <laughs> Church hasn't aged at all. It always looked old and like it had landed here from outer space. Bells were cracked too. I gave off this eerie, atonal clang. Weird, I had no memory of that second ago. Now I can almost hear him. Don't know how it's possible, but... I think I hear those bells, too. Seriously? You can hear my memories? It must be a side effect. Ah! Closed. Shame. Could look for another way inside. Be my guest. You like going to this church? Never actually went to church. Never even really paid attention to it. It was just there, you know? Once we knew Laguna Bend was to be flooded, people gathered here to plan a protest. Did it achieve anything? <sighs> look around. Found an opening. Think we're safe to go through here. On my way. Snuck in here once when no one was around. Stood at the altar and tried to imagine what went through the Padre's mind, looking at all those people. Back then I wondered how he could read people's thoughts and know everything about them. Then I screamed at the top of my lungs to check the acoustics. Didn't get chased off? Ran out myself. Echo, I got back scared because of the bejesus out of me. Thought it was that crush I had on Jenny Chapman. All that guilt I tried yelling out. Flew right back in my face. Passed out. How'd you manage to lift me out? Dunno, didn't think about it. Just did what I had to do. Hey, careful. Easy now. So, you're saying you saved my life. Thank you. Told you diving into this toxic waste was gonna end badly. But you just don't fucking listen. Toxic waste? Is that your construct? You heard him? Uh, heard's overstating. It's just surfaced in my head. A thought that wasn't mine or completely yours. Please just ignore his babbling. It's a mm, complicated relationship. Why do I even bother? Doubt you should go back to the city just now. I'm pretty beat too. Last thing I want to do is drive. Let's stay the night. What do you think? Why the hell not? Whose cottage is that then? You said you knew the owner. One of our neighbors was hell-bent on staying in Laguna Bend. 
Padges literally dragged him out of his house before the water came in. So he built himself another house as close as he possibly could, but then he got sick. Water was way more toxic back then. Must be chilled to the bone. I'll brew a pot. How do you take yours? Milk and sugar, please. Going all in, huh? Ah, forgot to start the generator. A generator? <laughs> What's next? Jacuzzi? <laughs> Finnish sauna? No, but there is running water. I could turn it on. You're gonna take it easy. Promise to take it slow. Think you could have fine-tuned the emotive wave transmitters better back there. Got some serious surges from you a few times. Power's up. Your little spa is open for business. Judy? What was that? Couldn't hear you clearly. Something the matter? No, nothing. Don't bullshit me, Judy. We're still synced, remember? Clouds has gone to shit. Tiger Claw no next took revenge for Hiromi and the rest. There was a firefight. Tom's dead. Roxanne barely got out alive. House is closed until further notice. I'd rather not talk or think about it. I didn't want to tell you. Wanted this to be just our day. I want it. It is ours.
Will you sit with me a while? Here's your coffee. Finally. Morning. So. Yesterday. What was that exactly? Don't remember, or you want me to remind you? You know exactly what I'm trying to say. What did it mean, like, to you? I think it... I mean... I hope it was the beginning of something nice. Unless you see things differently. Ugh. It can be such a gonk sometimes. Ruined my plans, you know that? Was gonna leave Night City in the dust for good. Even started packing. But now, I think... I think I gotta stay. Ah, oh, well. Guess I'll have to make it up to you, won't I? Hmm. Yeah, that would be appropriate. Give me your hand, V. Why? What for? Don't say anything. Just give me your hand. All set. Congrats. Just gave you unlimited access to my pad. Whoa. Uh, asking me to move in? If it's what you want. Or just drop by when the urge grabs you. I don't know what to say. Nobody's ever done anything like this for me. It really shows trust. Wanna go there now? You can if you want. Gonna stick around for a bit before I head back. See ya, Judy. Patience is a virtue. Oh, hey! Hi! Hey, how's it going? Not coming? Not really my jam, picnics. But you have fun. Spinning a new song anyway. Rather focus on that. Glad you're here. I need your help cooking. What's on the menu? Jambalaya. Come on. You can stir the meat. Uh, soy meat. Okay. This an ancient ward family secret. Uh-huh. Onions, paprika, thyme. Just need to mince some celery and garlic. But you stir, please. Stir. I'm stirring, I'm stirring. Bet my socks you've never had better jambalaya. How's Randy holding up? He's looking for his old self. Physically, though, it'll be a long road before he's back to full health. And mentally? That was some experience. What Harris did to him, fucked as this might sound, might have helped the kid. Could be wrong, but feels like a clean break for him. Somehow look different than usual today. Is that so? Gotta yeah. keep mixing if it's not different gonna burn. Different meaning normal. <laughs> As if you got a good night's sleep. Hmm. Well, wanted you to see this side of me too. Honestly, thought you were kidding about the cook-off. 
Or that Joss had sweat away in the kitchen while... Oh. Joss doesn't know the first thing about cooking. Actually, I like to torture foodstuffs. <laughs> Haven't had many opportunities lately. Don't mean to spoil a nice day, but... I gotta ask. What about Peter Pan? You're asking if I killed him. We'll talk later, okay? Sure. No pressure. It's just I... You know. I know. All right. Think you've stirred enough? Mind grabbing the rice from the kitchen? Yes, sir. No, Randy's always been that way. But I'm sure this didn't help none. You know, his father was a difficult man, too. That's exactly what I told him. But he always got the same speech back. Nobody cares about these kids who don't exactly fit the mold. How you doing, Joss? I'll call you back later. Really nice of you to come. Thanks for having me over. I should be thanking you. How's Randy? Still in the hospital. Still in shock. But he's making progress. Haven't had a chance to tell you just how grateful I am. What matters is it's over now. I just don't know how to repay you. If Randy Don't had... owe me a thing, Joss. Thank you. River's out back. You know? He can't seem to stop gushing about you. Basmati, nice. Tomatoes in next. Now you can toss in the rice. Rice is in. Okay, now this has to bubble and brew. Patio. Grab a chair. And a beer or something else. It's nice out here. Yeah. Seems all good. Like nothing bad ever happened. Tell me now about Harris. I paid him a visit at the hospital. He's still in a coma? Yep. In a strange slumber between life and death. An empty shell in a hospital bed. One shot to the head. Quick and clean. I had the same thought. It would be so easy. I pressed the gun to his head and remembered something. River. How my parents died. Now, oh, sure you want to hear this? What happened? Old man had a farm, like Harris's dad. But when business took a turn, well... My parents managed to open a small grocery. We lived on the floor above. A loud noise woke us one night. They wanted cash. Register was empty, so they stormed upstairs, forced us all to kneel, and demanded my dad tell him where he hid the money. River, you don't gotta go on. Heard sob stories enough? No, just... This is tough, I can tell. You really don't need to rehash it now. Okay, yeah. You're probably right. Just... 
Harris. What did you do? Had the gun to his head and... I've ended a few lives in my time. But never like that. Never an execution. Slipped out of the hospital quick. Told myself the case was closed. That's good. But when now? You're not going back to the PD? P.I. has a nice ring to it. Who knows? Uncle we'll River, see. you said you'd play with us. You promised. All right, all right. Let's go. V, join us? What are we gonna play, Uncle River? You'll see. Dorian, we're playing! Yeah, big trouble in Haywood. Grab your set. think always wanted to try a game like this well well nice firepower there this is no time to get distracted we can't let that filth get away Who? oh well look at you V allow me to introduce Captain Joan McLean and Lieutenant Henry Callahan they're our precincts best and brightest wouldn't want to get in their way I always work alone. No exceptions. Even for you. Yeah! Me too! Oh, I've heard of cops like you. The lone wolf type. That's right. Thorns in their commander's side. Rebels who play by their own rules. I've been suspended one time. Retired two times. And kicked off the force three times. I'm getting too old for this. But something always drags you back. The city needs me. All right, let's get to it. All right. All we gotta do is track down El Chamuco in Diablado and take out his lackeys along the way. He'll pay for his crimes. We'll play like two teams, us and the kids, but we work toward the same objective. The team with the best result wins. You don't stand a chance. AV, just go easy, okay? It's their favorite game. Sure. Get him! The city's mine! You'll never take her from me! <laughs> He's fast, but not fast enough to escape justice! Watch out! It's his cronies! He's hit! He's hit! Next round! Next round! This way. It must be their rat-infested hideouts. I could smell the moral decay from a mile off. Mm, quiet. Too quiet. It's a trap! They were waiting for us! <laughs> Too slow! Too many donuts! Not done yet! Ah, behind us! Not half bad. Okay, that's all of them. But next time we gotta be faster. Out of the way, citizen. Obstructing justice is punishable by law. This is your last warning. Easy there, Captain. I'm just passing through.
that all you got? Nah, watch this. I think we got them all. But it's not over yet. Some last words? Fine. Out with it, scumbag. I want to see you squirm. No. Your last words. <laughs> Okay, so now... Lunch is ready. Uh, but, Mom, you almost had him. Oh, you'll get him next time. At least we beat the grown-ups. We're the best! Thanks for letting them win. They had fun. Oh, <laughs> they're great kids. It's no problem. Seems they took a liking to you, too. Hey, food's on the table. So, was your game fun? Awesome! <laughs> we kicked their big butts! The bad guys? Huh? Oh, yeah, the bad guys, too! Time to see if this tastes as good as it smells. Unemployment's being good to you. You seem good. River's discovering the joys of family life. That and police duty. Never a good mix. This here's a way to get some of those years back. I haven't seen him this... untroubled in a while. What about you, V? You got a family? Or just relations? Grew up in Haywood. Whole street was my family. Neighbors helped each other out. Thought nothing of it. Well... You brought my family back to me, and I'm grateful. If you say so, Joss. And my brother likes you. Joss. Well, why hide it? Probably asked you to say that himself, didn't he? Wow. How did she know? Come on, Joss. You don't see wedding bells in my future, surely? Why not? Who thinks me and Uncle River make a good couple? <laughs> I do. <laughs> v just voted. Well, that's decided. Got an 1199. Officer needs backup. Come on, pull you out of this ambush. Thanks, Joss. Yeah, thanks. Whew, situation was getting dicey. That's what partners are for. You were about a hair's breadth away from having to look at photo albums. Here we are. What are we looking at? A water tower. Great spot. Great for what? For, you know, the views. The views, right. This way, I... oh, fuck. Gate stuck again. Gonna fix it one of these days. Let me give you a boost. Climb over, open it from the other side. Yeah, okay, good. Okay. On our way. Area's not bad, actually. Unlikely to dazzle. Make a good first impression, though. Certainly no Corpo Plaza. No. But life's livable here. No worse places to raise kids. Randy's problems with the law. Those didn't pop out of thin air. True. But Randy takes after his old man. He'd find trouble in a nicer neighborhood, too. Oh, 
Apparently the worst city between the Atlantic and the Pacific. But I sure do love this view. Find it calming. Out here, you can't smell the shit corpse dump on the streets. Like the city's their own personal toilet. Shit flush repeat. Hmm. Poetic. Couldn't have said it better. Got something for you? Your piece? Had her a long time. Too long. I think it's time she found a new owner. Don't know what to say. Just promise you won't blow your foot off. Oddly specific request. Josh's husband did it. Drunk. This very spot. Which made this your special spot. Family landmark? Something of the kind. All right, V. You know why we're here, don't you? Say you do. Please, don't string me along. That the pickup line you settled on? Because maybe heard three in my life that were worse. And just a little, I thought. Wouldn't mind hearing them. Yeah. Happy to oblige. Will you swallow? Beautiful. <laughs> you serious? This guy and I, sitting in a diner. Five minutes, he gapes at me. Not a word. Then, drops that bomb. Oof. I'll fuck you for free. <laughs> what? Got a contract. To pull info out of a gigolo in a tech mink fedora. It was weird, he was... Spill in, and then he pulled that one out of his hat. A candid and generous proposal, V. You should have at least considered it. So I'm at a bar, and this gonk taps me on the shoulder and says, Here I am, baby. You got two wishes left. <laughs> What'd you say? Spoke my second wish. That he would fuck off. Was there a third? Mm-hmm. Wished him a speedy recovery. Broken arm. Merciful, I'd say. Okay, last one was good. You know, woman once told me I have sexy calves. That's it? Just like her boyfriend's. Before he lost his legs in the war. Yikes. She was right, though. I do have great calves. I see what you're doing, River. And how am I doing? Do I stand a chance? Just don't fall in love with me. Too late, V. Too late.
Christ, V. Can't believe you're making me fuck a cop. Gonna go plug my ears, gouge out my eyes. Hey. Hey. Coffee will be ready in a jiff. <sighs> oh, Prem. Talked in your sleep, you know? Yeah. I dreamt of a warehouse, searching containers in it. Warehouse must have been huge. <laughs> you were loud. Taste it. Best coffee you've ever had, I bet. Best jambalaya, best coffee. Mm-hmm. Come on, keep it coming, and... Just that. So, I've been thinking. What? Last night, you and me. Is this going anywhere, you know, longer term? Listen, River. What happened... It was real. It was good. But... I can't make any plans for the future. There's this thing... That you couldn't tell me about. I know. Call it veteran cop intuition. It's why I tried to tell you something yesterday. About myself. To give me courage? Boost it? Oh, uh, no. So you'd know exactly how fucked up I am. Give you a chance to consider if you even want me. River, I'm dying. Wanna haggle on? Try to outdo that? What? Wasn't just me you spent the night with. Sharing headspace with a construct I caught like some disease. All because of an experimental Arasaka biochip. Construct? You mean like somebody's mind? Mm-hmm. An engram of Johnny Silverhand. Yes. That silver hand. And it's getting worse. But... Sorry, still not following you. You're talking to V right now. But tomorrow, this could be a self-obsessed dickhead rocker boy. And trust me, you don't want to talk to him. How is that even possible? He's... Displacing my own neural net, River. Gradually destroying my brain. But it's reversible, right? Uh, there's no way it could actually kill you. Actually, doesn't look promising. Need to excise him. Get him out of my brain before it's too late. Shit. Still want to be my boyfriend? Who do you take me for? Of course I do. This doesn't change a thing. Question is, what do you want? Are you willing to give this a shot? This works, River. I like being around you. Let's give it a try. Let's give it a try. But if it doesn't work, we'll still be friends, right? Let's not get ahead of ourselves, okay? Sure. Yeah. Good morning. Not intruding, I hope. The generator? You remember, right? Oh, fuck. Need me to fix it now? Yeah, now. Then we go to the hospital. I'd rather have everything ready for when Randy gets back. Don't mind me, and tell Randy I said hello. Oh, damn. Oh, sorry, V. Will I see you later? Yeah, sure. Have a good day, then. What's up with the generator? I don't know, but electricity's out. And then his room needs tidying. I'm supposed to do that? I know how it sounds, but this one time, please. 